Good morning. Welcome to the WCCE Morning News Show. My name is Maylund. I'll be your anchor for today, Thursday, January 6, 2022. This is week four for activity classes. Here's Caitlin with the weather. The current temperature in Lake Wiley, South Carolina is 38 degrees. Today's high is 59 degrees. The low tonight is 31 degrees. The forecast for today is partly cloudy. Now back to our anchor. Thank you. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I salute to the flag of South Carolina and pledge to a part of state, love, loyalty, and faith. At Crowder's Creek, we pledge to seek smart solutions, be on board learning, act responsibly, and respect others. And now for a moment of silence. Today for lunch, we will have cheeseburger crispy chicken salad. Dr. Dickey, Miss Hamilton, and Miss House would like to wish a happy birthday to Anna K. Cox, Grant James, and Scarlett Sides. Please see your teacher for a birthday pencil. Happy Thursday, boys and girls. I hope your morning is off to a great start, and I hope you are bundled up and layered. Please remember to keep a close eye on the weather and watch those temperatures so that we can make sure we are dressing appropriately and doing everything that we can to keep ourselves safe and in school each and every day. Boys and girls, before we left for winter break, that was the final day of the second quarter, and hopefully you have given your best effort because report cards will be going home. Please be sure to share them with your parents to discuss your progress, talk about what is working well, talk about areas of improvement if there are areas where you can improve, and know that we have the second half of the school year to still end on a very positive and high note. So again, make sure you're giving your very best effort because we are officially in the third quarter of school and this is the time of the year where it starts to go by really, really quickly. So you always want to make sure that your grades are reflecting all of your hard work and just the high aptitude that you have for academics. As promised, I am getting caught up on all of my shout outs and thank you again for keeping them coming. Teachers, thank you again for recommending students for the SOAR. SOFA, please continue to keep those referrals coming as well. And students, don't forget, any staff member can recommend you. So it's, that's why it's important to SOAR everywhere you go. So now without further ado, here are some shout outs for today. This shout out is for Harrison because he is a great and helpful friend. This shout out is coming from Penelope Joshi and it is for June. She says, June has been awesome in class. She is a good friend and is good at math. She makes sure that everyone is okay and she is an amazing friend to me and so many more people. She also goes above and beyond. Good job, June. This shout out is coming from Ashlyn. Ashlyn would like to give a shout out to Kate in third grade because she is always on board with learning. And she actually drew a nice picture to go with your shout out, Kate. And we also have a shout out from Ashlyn for Addison Kirk. I would like to give a shout out to Addison Kirk and Ms. Powell's second grade class because I always see her on board with learning and I think that she should be on the silver sofa. So keep working hard and hopefully you'll be joining us soon, Addison. And last but not least, this shout out is coming from Micah. And this shout out is for Nola McCready for being respectful. She is a good friend and she is also very funny. So thank you again, boys and girls. I still have a bag full, so I'm gonna try to get caught up on my shout outs this week. But in the meantime, teachers and staff members, please keep the SOAR referrals coming and students, please keep the shout outs coming. We look forward to celebrating your success. Make it a great day. Today's winners of a book machine token are in Ms. Harville's first, first grade class, Addie Dustin, and in Ms. McElwain's third grade class, Madison Nelson. Congratulations to those students. That's all the news for today. Thank you for watching the WCCE Morning News Show. Have a great day.